uh, electricity line and then it becomes numb. Okay. okay? That's the whole idea. The steroid is mixed along with this. Okay. Yeah? So that it will be. And uh, we can get the spot beautifully seen. Yeah? And where we need it to go. And that's perfect. Okay. Good. Similar epidural injection? Yeah, I had like uh, seven years ago or eight years, I don't remember, uh, with you, so that's why I came back. Um, nice. And I was living my life normally. I got pregnant and I work out and I lift, and just uh, now I'm having this um, uh, pain again. So I thought I um, go come, for yeah, go for another one. Seven years back, when you, before having the epidural, you met a surgeon and you were told yeah. to have a spine surgery? Yes, that's right, that's right. And you went on the Google and you thought, let me yeah, have an epidural? Yeah, I just did some search and uh, I uh, knew about this epidural. Yeah, I, I, I don't nice. uh, want to go under the knife, you know, like I had a surgery before, 20 years ago, and I just don't want to go back to um, do another surgery. So I thought with uh, something that delay the surgery, so, and, How old are you? Uh, How old are I'm you? 35. Ah, so you have still a lot of uh, life to go without surgery. Yeah, as far as I, possible. I, you think? Yeah. <laughs> I wish, and yeah. uh, I have no problems in doing the epidural again for you. I hope and pray it gives you all the benefits. Yeah, I wish also. <laughs> I nice to have you. Thank you, Dr. Nara. Thank, thank you very much. Good morning, Madhya. Nice to have you back. Thank you. Uh, can you describe me what was the pain that you were having actually? Um, regarding the migraine or the yeah. um, Was it the bite pain? It was like uh, very painful and uh, throbbing kind of uh, mm -hmm. pain. It's very sh uh, shooting. Okay. And uh, I tried different sorts of medications okay. which didn't really help. Well, it did help, but only a little not, bit. Not and for a short period of time. And then, uh, and then uh, you, how did you know that you can do? Some intervention in the From Dr. Ami, the new one. Okay. He was so the one who guided yeah. me to this. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. Yes. And then what did the graphic procedure done by us here? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, we did the uh, bilateral, occipital nerve block. Occipital. And we also did the supra uh, scapular, scapular and nerve block. And now, after I did those three blocks, yes. you feel there is some good yes, relief? Yes, there is some good relief. Very yes, good relief. Definitely. And you are happy about it? Yes, I'm definitely happy. I'm very satisfied with it. Okay. You have also been having complaints of crescent yes, joint pain? Yes, crescent joint, yes. Only recently, that was six months ago. Okay. Yes. I think good. this one uh, actually uh, arose from uh, a very far uh, uh, injury I had almost 19 years ago. Old trauma. Yes, an old trauma. So now it is touching me. It's really getting a very electric, you know, it's very degenerative and especially that I am not doing any kind of exercise. Okay. When I used to do exercise, I was able to mask the pain. Okay. The, the pain was, was done because of the strong ligaments and muscles. Yeah. No, but now since, yes, yeah, it's, it's all coming control. back and it is... And you know. you've been taking medicine for the yes, I've been taking apoxia, physiotherapy, physiotherapy didn't work, and exercise, yes, didn't work. Then you went and met some surgeon also? Yes, neurosurgeon, Dr. Hassan Kadri, he was the one who guided me and, and told me that... Uh, that Were you happy with what uh, he gave you some injections? He gave me injections, but unfortunately the cortisone injections didn't work. Didn't In work. fact, it, I'm sorry to say this, it made it worse. Okay. You know, it made it a little bit worse. Today what we are planning to do is we do a crescent joint uh, radio frequency operation okay. and uh, we do this on a routine basis. I will be happy to see the feedback from you. For sure. 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 Nice to have you and Thank I'm you. so happy that at least Thank the pain you. is being controlled. And I'm uh, very happy that the suprascapular and the occipital block we gave yes. has given you a relief. In fact, we've been noticing this uh, as a routine for a lot of patients yes. who've been having severe headache, yes. neck pain. Yes. Uh, though it is uh, sometimes even migraine type of pain, 
Uh, people are doing a lot of medications yeah. and still they have not no yes. release. And when we started doing this injection therapy for the supraskapsular and occipital, we have found very good results. So I'm happy that you also Thank have you so much, Doctor. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Yeah. I really we will do this. I'll give you some sedations okay. and then I'll put you on your on your abdomen. Okay. They clean the place okay. and then we will go in and identify each point okay. and that's the block. Okay. And you will be able to guide us also when we do sure. that. Sure. Yeah. So I'll be fully conscious. So we will be conscious, but uh, the sedation will keep you comfortable okay. so that you don't uh, feel uh, okay. yeah. Okay. But then you will be conscious enough to guide me. Okay. And sedation will make you comfortable to lie on till at least. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.